Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode. This is my first one ever starting in, um, in the field. I figured it wasn't worth it to go all the way back. So we're going to get a picture of a Jackson's chameleon first and a picture of the Maasai boy and an oryx before we go home today. Whoop, my lovely driving skills. So, chameleon, the adorable, adorable chameleon, is, or should be, right here. <laughs> I don't know if this is the best view of him, though. So he's got a, he's got a pretty standard animation. I'm going to see if I can get him with his tongue out. We'll see. Oh, here comes the fly. Here it goes. Uh, I don't know if I got it. Let's see. Nomp. Nomp. Oh, not bad. I'd probably use that one, but I think I prefer the angle on the hill better. Of this guy. Damn! <laughs> He's too fast! Alright, let's go find the Maasai boy and the Oryx. Uh, we wanna go the other way for the Oryx. I wonder if... <laughs> I know. There is no Cappy at one point that comes here, and I don't know if if it's something that I trigger. I think it's just a matter of time after the Oryx. After the Oryx mi missions come the Okapi. So we will see you at Corora Gorge very shortly. All right, let's see if we can spot the Oryx. Who is an extremely shy creature. And there's always only one of them. Oh, there he is. And I totally just scared him. Come back here with my slow moving. Ah, oh, there we go. Let's get a picture of an oryx. It doesn't need to be close at all, luckily. All right, to the Maasai boy. Is the Maasai boy here? Hmm, he's not here today. All right, home we go. All right, we are taking a picture of a chameleon. Let's take that one. Hmm, I wonder what angle could have been better. All right, save. All right, sleep time. Mail. The oryx and its long horns. Remember that photo I had you take of the giraffe and sunset motif? Well, we have been flooded with requests for a follow-up. You should be proud. I say, let's give them what they want. 
we can keep the sunset theme, but let's switch up the animal. How about an oryx? The one with the long sword-like horns. As usual, we need a vertical shot. Thanks. Eh, this is a tough one. Uh, the proud war rogue warthog. Hey there, Mr. Famous Photographer. Uh, I, I'm a miss. That's okay. I got another job for you. I heard a fascinating story the other day about a warthog who travels about the Duma Steppe all by itself, a lone wolf, if you will. I never thought I would call a warthog cool, but that was before today. Think you could snap me a photo of this rogue hog? Uh, weird. I don't know. Huh, interesting. To help boost sales. Hey Robin, it's me again, Bill, over at the project sponsored Tsitsi. Can I ask you a favor? I want you to snap a photo of a scarab. They're supposed to be really lucky, and we could use the sales boost right now. I want to put the photo on my desk at my office. Aren't I clever? That's awesome. I have not actually seen that guy before. So we will totally do this one. I'm going to do them Cyboy first. Um, I have no idea. The next cover photo is of an Oryx against a backdrop of a setting sun. The silhouette of an Oryx will stand out beautifully against the sun. Don't forget to take the photo vertically. This is a tough one. The Oryx is super skittish. The sun doesn't set for very long at all. Let's actually see what this mission is. Um, rogue shot on Duma Step. Okay, so we just have to find the Warthog on Duma Step. That's not too bad. Because I haven't done that one before. And uh, what's the other one? This one, I think mission help boost sales oh scarab all right i think i know where it is but i haven't done the mission before so that'll be an interesting one all right i'm going to get a quick picture with the maasai boy we're gonna go look for a scarab and the warthog and then we'll end off with the Oryx at sunset, because that's not tough at all. I'll see you guys soon. Never mind. We are apparently doing the <laughs> warthog first. What's that, Robin? Can you get a view of it from over there? A cheetah is chasing after a warthog. They're heading this way. Robin, get your camera ready. All right, so I guess I find the warthog first. And since it's stupidly at... Capture highlight of a cheetah versus warthog. Big game hunt number 16. I kind of wish that I'd waited for daylight, but all right, it is on. This music is amazing. What am I waiting for? I've never done this one before. Go, Warthog. You away, Cheetah. At first, the cheetah was chasing the warthog. But the tables turned, and the cheetah ended up being the one chased. I guess that, I guess that means the cheetah's, oopsies. The cheetah must be there still. Ha ha ha! He's like, yeah, man. Did you see that? Did you see that? I was so cool. Yeah, you are tough as nails, buddy. Alright, where's that cheetah gone? I wonder if they... Left the cheetah around somewhere. Alright, let's continue on. Uh, 
All right, so our next order of business is to snap a photo with the fantastic Maasai boy who helps us out every so often. Who I haven't actually used as much this episode, or this uh, playthrough. Usually if I needed him, he'd point me towards lions or other such things. I think he showed me where a few of the skulls were sometimes. He's sitting here today. Let's take an awesome picture of him. Yes, Oryx does not seem to be in this area. Let's get... Hmm. It's really dark. I'll take it... Here. Alright, buddy. Let's do a jump for these guys. Oh. Alright, looking at the camera. Oops. This one. Yay! <laughs> Let's get it one down, too. I wonder if I can... Move over a bit. I think maybe I'm too far from him. Alright, one more up. Yeah! Alright, that should be good. Because I don't think I can go any closer than that. Yep. Yeah, it should be great. Yay! <laughs> uh, we'll take this one. That's kind of a tough shot. I don't think I can set it up anywhere else. No, because he'd be in the... Oh, well. Alright, where's our truck? Where did I park? There we are. Okay, we're gonna go find a scarab beetle next because it's in this area. Uh... Somewhere. I think in the... Uh... Hmm, hmm, hmm. Kongadi Wilds. So that's where we gotta find these scarab. So we are... Gonna go straight-ish. I haven't actually seen this guy before. Apparently he's tough to find. And hopefully he's actually there. Alright, so I'm supposed to find a needle in a haystack. How in the world do I do that? Maybe that's him? These poor buzzards, or uh, vultures, are gonna fly away. Yeah, how am I supposed to find this guy? I will definitely be editing on this one, I'm sure. Holy crap. I wanna know if this guy's it. Oh my god, I have eagle eyes. Wow. Mr. Speck. Oh, I get lost you. Anyways, let's take a picture of you. Too bad we don't have macro on. Weep, 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 weep. Hi, buddy. Let's see if we can get any closer to you. Oh man. Oh man. Where's my continuous shooting on? Manual exposure, yeah. Alright. Seeing as you'll come into shot. Oh my gosh, you're cute. You roll that dung, sir. 
That should be good. I don't know if I should, maybe I'll get one from a side angle. Ugh, where are you? Oh, there you come. Into shot. Alright, that's good. Perfect. Alright. Let us go to the um, Koroa Gorge and get that stupid Oryx and Sunset. And that is going to be a lot of me waiting for the sun to set. Could you imagine if this was not edited? That would be a lot of boring. <laughs> I'll have to show you guys what one of my uh, one of my finished finished uh, Vegas reels looks like, which is what the program that I use to edit these uh, game captures in. But it's definitely the most editing I've done of any game so far. And I thought Tulip was a lot for that. But yeah, usually I film for about an hour and I cut it down to 20 minutes. Because 40 minutes of it is just waiting for that perfect shot. You guys get to see the best bits, which is awesome. Alright, see you guys soon. How does one always lose an oryx? Like, seriously? How is that even possible? Ooh, that's a nice shot. And don't forget to take it vertically, Robin. How'd that turn out? Beauty! I'm even gonna take one of those as my title card because if you guys haven't noticed, which I'm sure you have, I use these for title cards. All right, enough of that lollygagging. Time to take a uh, picture of a oryx at sunset with the sun in frame. Whoop. I still need you, oryx. Hopefully these turn out. Oh. Don't focus on the... Uh, maybe I'm... I think I'm a little too... I got so lucky with him drinking the entire time. Like, super lucky. I think that's it for me. Ooh, that was a nice one. Let's hope that turns out. just for a title card because why not you work that magic giraffes oh two drinking giraffes and a fantastic oryx I hope those turned out I have no idea wish me luck everyone I think I, I've got a good feeling about those ones though Oh, look, you can see the oryx and the two giraffes drinking there. That's neat. No, we are not camping here. 
I thought it was just a pre-rendered scene every time, but I guess they kind of take, you know, what's happening at the time. All right, let's do the E E E. Masai boy. Whoops. First. Let's do this one. <laughs> oh, we squeaked by with an A. <laughs> uh, published in the photo collection, the Maasai, the nomadic life. All right, let's go for the dung beetle. Um, oh, those look like they didn't turn out. Meh. Sadness. Which one do we want? These ones are quite close. Hmm, let's take that one. All right, let's uh, let's do the oryx. Ugh, that's sad that it might. Ah, uh, ah, uh, that sucks. Those were such nice shots too. Well, crap. Maybe this one, or the. Uh, let's see. We got this one. This one. Ah, uh, that's sad. We got this one. Which is nice. Ah, uh, we'll try this one. Mmm, B. Those ones are tough. Published in National Geographic, Source of Life, The Sun. Let's see, let's see how it cut off things. <laughs> Whoa. Ah, that turned out nice. And wow. Oh well. <laughs> nice. All right, let's sleep. How many bees do I have now? I've definitely racked up a few, that's for sure. Eleven bees. Oh well. Email! <laughs> oh, we forgot this one. Let's do this one. Ah, uh, I wish I'd been a bit better with that. Uh, silly, let's take that one. Silly Eland. What? Sorry, guys. Some bees for sure. Hey, Robin, I've got a photo request here from an auto manufacturer, and this one's a doozy. They want an African elephant charging towards the camera. Please be careful. Also, could you take it in Kuroa Gorge? They saw the picture you took of the elephant taking a bath and liked the scenery. You professional you. Uh, some of these missions are so cruel. This is a tough order. If we photograph an elephant charging towards us, we could end up being the endangered species. Well, let's try Kuroa Gorge. The elephants are often found at Poli Poli Falls. That is the only mission we have active right now. I hope they give me more. This is a big game hunt, by the way, so we will so see you shortly at Kuroa Gorge. While I drive like a maniac through this place. Bye bye for now, guys. Alright, so we have reached. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Hard beast. Uh, we have reached our next mission area.
which I can't stand this one. There are elephants at Poli Poli Pol 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 Falls. Let's drive up to that elephant and take a picture. Let me drive. I'll try to get as close as possible. Yeah, I hate this one because, um, <laughs> shoot a close up of an African elephant. Big game number 14. Like how often of, of, of a mission, how awful of a mission is that? That was close. I guess I went a little too far. You think, Eric? I think I'm better off letting you handle the driving. Yeah, because the two times that we've had missions with you doing it, you've caused stampedes. All right, let's go home because we have nothing else to do here. And I think we'll have time for one last mission after this, maybe. All right, let's send this mind risking your life photo. I know, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I could totally see clipping around the elephants one ear and I fixated on it. I did want to remind people that this game, uh, or the PS3 is region free, so you guys can pick up a Korean or Chinese copy of this and it'll be fully in English if you guys want to play this yourselves. Mail! Luckily. New product in stock. Ooh, thank you for your continued business. In this newsletter, we would like to introduce the king of the alpha lenses, the 300 millimeter F 2.8G is an interchangeable lens for a Alpha series whose shocking price has nothing on the shocked expressions of your friends' faces when they see its striking white body. Visit the pro shop for more details. Holy crap, that is expensive. Uh, confirmation of the black rhinos in Manyanga. Oh, Robin, it looks like you still haven't found any black rhinos in the course of your research. That's too bad. The black rhino population has seen a sharp decrease, making them a major focus of the Foundation's efforts. Unfortunately, there are so few in number now that we can't even locate where they are. If you see one, please send us a photo ASAP. I can totally do that. We will also uh, accept this mission. All right, uh, my lovely. So... I basically did something stupid. I stopped recording because I think I got a phone call from my dad or whatever. One of those random inane things. And I forgot to hit record again. So I totally went to see the Black Rhino and did the entire mission without bringing you guys along. So I'm going to show you guys where he is. Uh, he should be around here somewhere. And we will continue with more Black Rhino missions next time because by the time I submitted... Where is he? By the time I submitted my photo of him, I realized that I wasn't recording anymore. And now I feel like I'm making him up. Well, isn't that strange? Alright guys, 
since we've gone well enough over and I made that foolish mistake, uh, we will continue this next time and see more black rhinos on the next episode of Africa or Hakuna Matata. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you liked it. Bye for now.